Hello and welcome back to Come Geek Some. If you are new to the channel, please like and subscribe for future content. Well, Twitter can be a lovely place. So, Star Wars, so the official Star Wars Twitter account, put up the following. If you were part of the Star Wars universe, what side would you be on? Star Wars Celebration, so would you either be on the Resistance or the First Order? Well, this is where the fun comes in now, and this is where all the SJWs who thought they were being funny or whatever, but then the majority of them deleted their accounts. So, you got Rick Soft Fine Horcrux, he goes, uh, well, hopefully not the fucking space Nazis at Star Wars. You got another one. One of the sites presented a literal Nazis. You're asking people if they want to be space Nazis on Twitter in 2019. This is the dumbest question I've ever seen. No wonder we are where we are. You're literally glorifying the space Nazis and offering it as a choice. Burn it all to the ground. Sadly, asking Star Wars fans if they identify with the fucking space Nazis is a valid question these days. What the fuck? A reminder, someone at Disney signed off on this. Um, right, a quarter of Star Wars fans are Nazis. That explains a lot of the social media comments. Holy shit, Disney and Star Wars currently has a poll asking if you more closely align with freedom fighters or Nazis. One third align with, you guessed it, Nazis. Check it out. Excuse me for my dog in the background. He's just chewing his way through something. You got nothing? That side that isn't moulded out of present day Nazi fanboys, perhaps? Wait, is StarWars.com legitimising space Nazis? Who are you, the US President? Are you seriously asking people if they wish to be part of the Space Nazi Alliance? There are very fine people on both sides, Donald Trump. Also, a big F you to whoever at Disney Star Wars felt that asking people whether they'd like to be space Nazis was a good idea. Normalisation of fascism continues at Disney, I see. And it just goes on. There's literally so many more. There's literally 12 more. I'm not going to read them all, but I just find them really funny that these people think that uh, a quarter of people are Nazis. It really makes you see sense now with how these SJW types are because they are literally going out of their way just to say about Nazis and everything else. It's just like, wow, really? This is how you are all reacting, just to a poll on Twitter about fictional characters. It's, <laughs> I got it. I think it's funny as hell, to be honest with you. I really do think it's funny. Mostly because, well, again, it's fictional characters. It just makes you laugh when you, all, you see all these people. This is exactly what they're doing. And, you know, these are fictional characters. That's exactly what the majority of these SJWs say when people hate on The Last Jedi. Why are you upset over these fictional characters? But when it's uh, comparing someone to the Nazis or whatever, you just have to jump in, don't they? They just have to jump in. They just have to go, Oh my God, you're hating on them just because you're the Nazis. How dare you? You're saying someone's a Nazi. Look at all these a quarter of Star Wars fans are Nazis. It really does go to show just how really funny this is. It this is. Anyway, if you are new to the channel, please like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell for future updates, and we'll see you soon. Bye bye.